فلتصحبك السلامة في رحلتك باسم I knew it was you You are not the only one with eyes that see afar So, Tabed You have filled the streets with eyes and spies Such is the life of a Rafiq Without my knowledge, huh? where would we be? Knowledge is a tool, a weapon It can be used for good or ill and the Order is using it for ill indeed. What have you learned? Rot runs deep through the House of Wisdom. They are using some ancient book, hoping to build a wicked device. Mm. I have heard rumors of this blasphemous contraption. They call it their great work. The Order is experimenting on people, lethally. I have stopped them for now. But someone called El Rabisu is running things at the House of Wisdom. Mm. Any idea about who this Rabisu character could be? I have my suspicions about the great scholar, Fazil Fahim. That fragile old man? The clues I have gathered tell me so. Mm. It could be. The House of Wisdom will be hosting a great symposium soon. An informal gathering of scholars. A lecture, refreshments, chatter. Even the great Arib will attend. Go! Spy out this puzzle with care. But do not throw your blade at the symposium. We don't want to show our hand just yet. Hmm. But if Fazil is guilty and alone, then like a viper, strike. But you must be sure. Before I act, I will be sure. Symposium should be here. But that's brightest, sharing their wisdom. Scholar's lecture. Basil Fahim's lecture about the antediluvian antecedents of humanity will begin soon. In the meantime, please enjoy our ample stock of exquisite delicacies and tasty refreshments. Catch a whiff of her magnificent aura. So rare to see her outside of the round city. The beloved is in the garden, ruminating upon the perfection of nature. Oh, to be a flower held in her discerning hands, inspiring such languid verse. She must be relieved to be free of her wealthy patrons 
for a change. Oh, perhaps she leads an exciting secret double life. Slipping out of the palaces to find inspiration in common life. <laughs> I doubt it. I told you I'd see you around. Indeed. And what brings you back? I want to show you something. This house of wisdom boards collect the wildest trinkets and gadgets. I have been here before, Nihan. This is Ahmed ibn Musa's office. Have you been sneaking in there? Ahmed and his brothers are capable of designing some fantastic devices. Not all of his ideas are that practical, I'm afraid. Don't be so smug. The world is full of wonders. gives me a tingle down my spine. Like I'm nearing a cosmic secret. You read too much about magicians and lost cities buried beneath the dunes. You don't read enough. Perhaps there are other worlds, other people, out among the stars. Nonsense. Does this remind you of your nightmares? No. More like something from the Bimaristan, or a training chart of the Hidden Ones. Ah, yes. The swift ways to kill silently. Death in seconds. This. I have seen this one before. Is this what you wanted to show me? Yes. It reminded me of that object we found at the palace. What is it? A drawing from an ancient book. There is something you are not telling me. You do not want to know what happens behind closed doors. Why? Because you do not know either? Because, as Dirwish says, Sometimes it is better not to know the truth behind the things we must do. The truth, Basim, is that everything is here in front of you. But you refuse to look at it. This is about you. It has always been about you, ever since that night. I took an oath, Nihan. To leave my old life behind and walk this path of shadows. And maybe someday you will find the light. But until then, I will walk behind you every step of the way to remind you not to forget who you are. Is that a threat? I do not know. There is that poet a bit love. 
whose work keeps turning up in unexpected places. Yes? Symmetry of sky and sea, but only in thine eye do these two planes meet. You have read my work. And who might you be? A lover of poetry, nothing more. And of order. Or should I say, chaos. I know only one living poet who loves chaos that much. Ali ibn Muhammad. Are you a fan of his pedestrian work? The rivalry between you two is legendary. It enhances the craft. I cannot choose. You are most diplomatic. But I would rather seek inspiration among these lovely blooms. Good day. I know. I'm still nervous, but I couldn't stay away from my books. I guess we must always do our duty. Wadaan. That astronomer might be one of them, though I doubt it. Sayyidi, I am honored to make your acquaintance. Good to see more young people enjoying the House of Wisdom. Do you think the great scholar will give a good lecture? Do not waste time listening to his nonsense. I have written many more edifying and practical books instead. On which topics? I have written extensively about sundials, astrolabs, stars and planets, and the circumference of the Earth. Fascinating, Sayyidi. I shall read more of your work soon. What the hell? Sounds like the lecture is about to begin. I should return to the Kahriman. <laughs> Pardon me. Is Father Fahim's lecture ready to begin? Indeed it is. Head inside if you please. Welcome, one and all, to the House of Wisdom. Center of learning in Baghdad. Indeed, of the entire world. I am Fazil Fahim Al-Kimsa. First scholar of the House of Wisdom. Wisest of the wise. Today, I will shock you with what may sound like outrageous blasphemies. <laughs> Do not fear, good people. Though I am old, my mind remains sharp as steel. Today I speak of mysteries, of creatures from the antediluvian age. Do not the ancient prophets tell us about giants from before the flood? who forsook Allah and worshipped false idols? Is it not possible these giants built marvels, works of wondrous power, now lost to us? Zahra and Hassan are both dead, slain by an assassin's blade. They are dead. Sayidi, I urge you to hide until it's safe. 
Uh, apologies, people, but our lecture has concluded. Please, feel free to explore the House of Wisdom's many fine chambers. You call yourself the Great Scholar, Fazil. You who burn books and hope the smoke will hide your crimes. How many did you sacrifice in your search for knowledge? How many did you use, damage, and discard in the name of discovery? Now you hide within the House of Wisdom. The house you led astray. But I will find you. And I will exact justice for every soul you savaged for your great work. It is true. Fazil leads the Order in Abbasia. I need to hunt him down. Hey, it's him! Guard! The wanted man! He's over here! Hey, help! It's the criminal! He's here! Help! That's the one! Guard! Stop him! Don't let him escape! Gatekeeper! Let me pass! Those who came before are... What are you talking about? Those who came before are... Let me get back to you. I've lost Fossil's greatest word. Looks clear. I've lost I can use my weapons word. again if needed. What do you mean you lost the great scholar's masterwork? I'm sorry. I was distracted by the presence of the famous poet Arib. Forget the poet! We better find Fazil's book, or we're both dead. Sounds like part of a passphrase. How exciting. What do you think frightened the great scholar? The old fool must have imagined one of his antediluvian creatures. He's an absolute disgrace. But where did he run off to? There's rumors of hidden passages beneath the House of Wisdom. Maybe he hid down there. I have heard the rooftop gardener mention these places, yes. What a colorful detail to include in my verse. The scholar, by secret tunnels fled, chased by delusions of deities who want him dead. Pardon me, but I heard a rumor about a hidden basement beneath the House of Wisdom. A secret basement? You must be joking. No, not at all. Surely, such a large building must have basements and cellars to store books and inks. I'm aware of no such location on these premises. Perhaps a little token of my appreciation will jog your memory. Most generous. <sighs> Murders, mayhem, and bonfires. It's time for me to depart the House of Wisdom. Father has a fine carpet shop in Samara. He always wanted me to take up the family trade. A wise choice. Now, about any hidden cellars. Oh, yes, uh, of course. Forgive me. Now that you mention it, there is a basement hatch in the northwest courtyard. Thank you. Looks clear. I can use my weapons again if needed.
Wait, what? That book looks out of place wedged behind a desk like that. A history of the great scholar and his magnificent reforms of the House of Wisdom by Fazi Fahim. Not sure if this is the correct volume. I'll flay you when I find you. Now you rest. Hey! I know you're safe. Looks like somebody left a book in the stairwell. I want to talk to you. Better not use my weapons here. The Folly of Poetry by Fazil Fahim. Does not sound too romantic, to be honest. Wait, what? What? Don't you recognize what's left of you? Hold on! Yes! letter mentioned a private reading balcony. Might be where the reader had taken the book. Hey.
An impressive volume, written by Fazi Fahim, could be his masterwork. Its title is, Those who came before are those who shall return. This has to be it. I better not use my weapons here. Gatekeeper, those who came before are... ...are those who shall return. Correct! You may proceed. I can use my weapons again if needed.
My boat! Deep wrongness here. A reek of rot and iron. Those robes might help me get closer to Fossil. What have they done to these people? Poor guy will not need this anymore. This should help me blend in. that I have seen it all before. Somehow. Who dares meddle with my great work? Killing my allies and spoiling my lecture. It's an outrage. It looks like the handiwork of a trained assassin. Must be some faction in the round city. Or one of those jealous broods in Sharqi. These killings were too subtle for mercenaries. No matter. Once I understand how the mechanism works, I will prove myself to Al Bahamud. In here, Lackwit. You are new, aren't you? I don't recognize you. They promised you gold when you volunteered, yes? No matter. What you are about to behold surpasses all worldly riches. Don't be afraid. Are you afraid? This is my great work. I call it Arua. It will take you on a journey to another realm. Why did the first ones leave this world behind, filled with fools, I wonder, and make so few of me? We call this the House of Wisdom, but its foundations are unsound. 
For beneath the House of Wisdom lies the Dungeon of Ignorance. And upon such dark secrets we build our philosophies. Science is the noblest purpose. Knowledge is the greatest power. No. No? Then what? This may be the place. It may be here where lies absolute knowledge. It, it is not how I remember it. Behind the doors, it looked brighter. But in the end, all we see is darkness. I need to get out of here. Get back to the bed. question about it. Fazel was neck deep in the order. The scholar's notes. He believes in these ancient beings, the masters of memory. Ibn Ishaq. 
how did you find this place? Easy. I just followed the trails of blood. You should not be here. Do you talk to him? Sometimes. Yes. But he does not answer. I do. We have drifted apart since... Since that day. But what we have seen back at the palace... This light... These sounds... We cannot have possibly forgotten. Unlike you, Nihal... I keep the past... In the past. You call yesterday the past? And this Jinni of yours... This repulsive shadow that crushes your chest... Has it crawled back into the past too? No. It is still here. Sometimes, even in the day, I feel its breath on my neck. The nightmare invades the real world, or has always been part of it. This is part of your reality, Basim. I am a part of your reality too. I am your past. Tell me, will you leave me there? In the dark corners of your memory? I will not. Now, if you could invent a mechanical rug sweeper... Bossy, it is done. And how did it all play out? I'm afraid this is a tale for another day. We will save it for one of our campfires. You have done well, my friend. Better get back to my work. You know how easily I get bored. Thank you for what mm. you did, Basim. It is the truth. You have done well. One last thing. Arib. Was she... involved? Not that I know. But we must remain vigilant. Welcome. Do you have more questions? Thank you, Tim. Peace, friend. Well met. Have you any... Be my... Seen enough? Perhaps you... Take a look. Nothing else? Your goodbye.
Better keep a low profile. They will die for this, every one of them. It is time we fight. Your anger is just, but you will not win a war, Ali. Basim, good, you are needed. Mercenaries have taken some rebels and executed them in the square. And your Rafik would have me hide like a rat while they hunt my men openly. We must at least return the dead to their families. Do you still fear to fight these devils, Beshi? My only fear is that we become like them. There is more to this than it seems. The Khalifa would not risk war. This is the work of the Order. Then I will find those responsible and slaughter them like dogs. The Order will find you first. It's likely they are looking for you and Beshi already. You are well known to them. Basim, however... Ali, I will find who did this, and I will kill them all. You have my word. Basim is right. Let him do this. When those responsible lie dead, you will receive the credit. All right. Everyone must know it was me. I will return to Jarjaraya, but I will not wait long. I will meet you at the gate, Basim. And I will make sure the bodies are returned to the families for burial. That might have gone badly. You think this is the work of the Order? Yes. As you know, Shakia is run by Turkic mercenaries paid by the Khalifa, who himself is only a puppet for the Order. Spies tell me at least one of the mercenary commanders in Sharqiyah is with them. Tell me who, and I will find him. We must tread carefully. Sharqiyah stands on a razor's edge. The rebels are armed and growing in number. They could attack at any time. A misstep here could start a war that threatens even Elamut. What do you advise, Fulav? Go with Ali to Jarjaraya and look around. Someone there must know something. And Basim, work quickly. You see what is at stake. Hmm. I have some questions, Fula. I hope I have answers for you. What do the rebels want? You yourself know well the divide between rich and poor. Many have grown tired of the injustice and want change. In the beginning, it was mostly slaves, but now tradesmen, the wealthy, and even some nobles support Ali's cause. And Ali intends to lead them in overthrowing the Abbasid Khilafa. Ali believes the most qualified should rule, not just the wealthy or high-born. Ironically, he considers himself the most qualified and claims descent from the Prophet's own family to support it. Tell me of the Zenj. It is a bitter story. The Zenj are peoples stolen from their homelands in the Horn of Africa and brought here to work the fields for the wealthy. So they are slaves? They are paid, but they are not free. Like all men, they desire to be masters of their own lives. What do you know about Jarjaraya? It is a small village to the south, home to a divided population of rich and poor. Most of the Zench are there. 
It has also become a refuge for those who came to Baghdad looking for work and failed. No wonder Ali has gained support there. Yes. In few other places is the divide between those who have everything and those who have nothing so sharp. What of yourself, Fulav? How did you come to the hidden ones? That is a story that should be shared around the good fire after a long meal. Will you tell me nothing? I was the child of my father's concubine. His favored wife, worried I could claim inheritance, threw us both out. I grew up in the desert alone. My friends were the animals, particularly birds. We understood each other. That explains your love of eagles. After I grew to manhood, a hidden one saw me hunting with my birds. He brought me to the Brotherhood, and I stayed. Shukran, Fulad. That is all for now. Ali is waiting at the gate for me to go with him to Jarjaraya. Are you ready? We must go. Let us go. We must leave for Jarjaraya. Yalla, yalla! You hidden ones are strange. You give weapons you don't want me to use, then give me credit for your victories. War would be bad for everyone, especially you. That is your master speak. Does it not bother you that those you obey are the same ones who make the rules demanding your obedience? They do not control me. I am free. I fight so that others are free as well. Everything you do serves the hidden ones. That is a strange kind of freedom. The hidden ones are my family. There is no contradiction, if you say so. Once, I lived on the streets and answered only to myself. But I was not free. Now that others tell you who you are, are you any freer? You could not understand. I understand better than you. Us. 
If you are truly free, why the struggle within you? What do you mean? There is no struggle. I see that what you think is at war with what you feel. You will never find truth if you are not first truthful with yourself. No man can see what another thinks. No normal man. But look at me. I obey no one. I am ruled by no one. I am free. I do not know what... I want to look around before Beshi arrives in Jarjaraya with the bodies. That would be wise. People here are already angry. Things will be worse after the burials. There is a tea house nearby. Tea drinkers talk. You might hear something there about who is taking our men. What will you do? I have my own inquiries to make. Meet me back here if you discover something. This looks like the tea house Ali mentioned. A thousand apologies. Very good son, slaves go missing. Yet incompetence like you remain. Don't stop talking, just get my tea. Can work and what do you get? Nothing. Damn slaves. I treat them well. I pay them well. I feed them. And then they disappear. <laughs> and no one's left to work. He might talk. If I can sober him up. Time to sober up. Enough. Enough. I'm better. A tea house is a dangerous place to be drinking. You could have been arrested. I've just had a lot of trouble lately. You said some of your slaves have gone missing. Hmm. Did I? Oh, I don't remember. Uh, not just missing. They disappeared. People do not just disappear. These did. Last night, two of mine did not come back from the fields. No one saw anything. They just disappeared. Poof. So you thought you would get drunk in a public tea house? Well, yeah. Oh, my head. Look, do not tell anyone. I have to go home and fall over. you mentioned that slaves have gone missing. What? Who are you? How dare you talk to me? Go away! Perhaps a token will change your mind. How dare you? What do you... Wait. How did you come by one of those? Fine. But make it quick. You mentioned Zenj slaves have been going missing. I don't see what it has to do with you. But yes, a stranger. One of those rebels has been disturbing the slaves. After he spoke with them, they disappeared. No doubt he's an acquaintance of that troublemaker, Ali ibn Muhammad. That's all I know. Now, leave before someone who matters sees me talking with someone like you. Hey, over here. This one. Have you heard Did you want something? Not here. There are too many ears. If you take my meaning. Ah, yes, Sayidi. Our special teas are kept out the back. Uh, this way, watch your step. Follow me. Act casually. You fear your child may sicken. Are you anxious for their self-discipline? <laughs> 
<sighs> All right, it's clear. Well, we seem to be alone. What did you want? Sorry for the melodramatics, but you never know who's watching. And this sneaking about is all rather exciting. I saw your red sash and heard you talking about missing slaves. Another has disappeared from a farmhouse near here. How do you know of this? I am friendly with the family. The husband was one of those executed. Now the son has gone missing as well. His mother is beside herself with worry. I thought you might be able to help her. Tell me where this farmhouse is. A little to the west. Slaves don't trust easily. But if you can do anything for her, I would consider it a personal favor. I should return to Ali and tell him what I have discovered. We should not do this. It will only make more trouble for us. More trouble than executions? <coughs> they slaughtered our brothers. How do you not understand? Ali, what is this? This is not what we agreed to. I do what must be done. I do not need your approval. Did you discover something? Slaves are disappearing from all over Jarjaraya. One from a nearby farmhouse. I will go there and see what I can find. Good. Our friend here has been spending his mornings at the harbor, meeting with one we think is informing for the Khalifa. You could find this informant and follow him. See where that leads. Meanwhile, Beshi and I will loosen our friend's tongue. This is a mistake, Ali. Let us see. I should look for the informant, and help the widow find her missing son. This is the harbor. The informant is here somewhere. Let him see me. There is the mark. Now to keep them in my sights and avoid unwanted attention.
What have you got for me? Apart from that slave kid I already told you about, someone's been sniffing around Jarjaraya asking questions. What have you got for me? Apart from that slave kid I already told you about, someone's been sniffing around Jarjaraya asking questions. Uh, is it the one we reported last time? That troublemaker? Bashi. This one is new. No one seems to know anything about him. What are we doing then? I'm carrying letters for the boss and you're wasting my time! Come back when you've got a name. Son. Perhaps it is connected. This must be the place. Poor woman. I will need to... Excuse me. Who are you? What do you want? Forgive me. I did not mean to startle you. The tea house owner told me of your trouble. Perhaps I can help. I do not see how. I don't know you. You need flowers for your husband's burial. I too once lost those close to me, but could not bury them. It would be an honor if you let me do for you what I could not do for my friends. I will gather these flowers. My husband often brought some white savory to me. If you bring me some, I will leave them at his grave once he is buried. As my final gift. It will be done. The flowers will be nearby. I should look around. These look like the flowers I need. These are beautiful flowers. My friends would have approved. Get 
همیشه به من دیدی I brought the flowers with my sympathy. They are such elegant flowers. My husband loved them. Thank you. Is there something I can do for you? I am trying to find out who is taking slaves from Jarjaraya. I know your son is missing. Yes. I lost his father. It would be more than I can bear if I lost him too. Can you tell me what he was doing before he went missing? When his father was taken, he became very unhappy. He started going out at night. Last night, he never returned. I will look around. There might be something here that tells what happened. I could pick up her son's tracks around here. a nearby farm. I should let his mother know what I have found. from your son. He was looking for the men who took his father. Oh, that foolish boy! He mentioned a nearby farm. Do you know what he was talking about? Oh, no. That is Doan's farm. It is crawling with mercenaries. If he went there... Please, find my son. If he lives, I will send him back to you. You have my word. Doan's farm will be heavily guarded. I should return to Ali and discuss the next move.
the music of the spheres. The Khalifa is pleased to announce that the renowned scholar Abu Mahshar al balqi has published a new astrological treatise for your pleasure and instruction. You return at last. What have you done? What I had to do. Is this what your freedom looks like? I do not follow your creed, nor do I answer to the Hidden Ones. This is the price of war. Beshi would disagree. Beshi does not lead this rebellion. He does his part and I do mine. But enough. What have you discovered? The missing slaves were taken at the order of one called Duan bin Arslan. Something big is happening soon. I do not know what. I do. This one said my men are being interrogated and are to be executed by their leader afterward at the villa. Ali, the informant mentioned Beshi by name. They are looking for him. Let them look. Go free my men. I will prepare our attack on the villa. Meet me near the farm when you are done. This looks like the farm where Ali's men are being held. Forgive me, Enkidu. I lack vigilance. Hold on.
your fate is sealed. Your mother is waiting for you. I'm not going back yet. They killed my father. I will fight with the others. You are brave. Fine. Meet Ali outside the farm. There must be others being held nearby. God is great! God is great! There is no God but God. Is everyone here? The one bin Arslan dies now. We wait only for you. I am ready. Let us go. They stole you from your homes when you were free. And brought you here to die in their fields as slaves. They've slaughtered our brothers like dogs in Sharqiyah. Now they have taken more of us. No! No more! I promised you a new life. I gave you my word. More join us every day. From the least in Baghdad to the greatest. Allah is with us. Our cause is righteous. Our justice is destined. God is great. God is great. There is no God but God, and God is great. There is no God but God! There is no God but God! There is no judgment but by God! Dear God! You rebel in your place! Where is your friend? I know who you are. Oh, you know I'm in your head. Other will fight. I will tell you. We did it. The cowards are running. You want to fight now? When word gets out of this victory, 
Many will join our cause. Duan ben Arslan was carrying orders. He was to report to superiors at the officers' club in Sharkia. Those superiors may be who ordered the executions. Does it name them? It uses code names. El Ruch and El Aishma. Only the Order uses such names. I will go to this club and see what I can find. I wish you luck. I must return and wait for Beshi. Be careful, Ali. The Khalifa will be hunting you both after this. There are things we cannot hide from if we are to be truly free. I should go to the officer's club in Sharkia.